I'm not sure I was supposed to come up here yet. Um, which way did I come from? I want to go down and see if, uh, why is that glowing like that? Okay. Um, I want to get back down and see if I can use the, um, I'm going to finish the sentence here any minute now. <laughs> if the gardening tools, um, makes him remember something. His wife has a bit of temper. not the gardening tools. Finally, some peace and quiet. All her parties. How can anyone sleep through music blasting like that? I think she was on drugs. Walter was so tired, he could barely stay awake for the five miles it took to drive to Smithwick Quarry. I couldn't believe he was able to find a pair of lock cutters that late at night. At least the music has stopped. Now we can finally sleep. Ooh, okay, so she's at the quarry. Maybe if I stopped bringing him snacks, he... Yeah, I don't care about that one. Let me out of here. Okay, so... You got a better view of the street on TV. Can't influence him anymore. Oh, hey, what was that? I find an answer. Still missing two. Not going to try it yet. Oh, there's something. Break in at the quarry. Is 
So we still need one more clue. I don't know. Their neighbor left town in a hurry. Maybe they had nothing to do with it. Corey. Oh, because I guessed the wrong one first. I didn't get three badges or whatever. one. That's two. And I'm going to guess that's three. Nope. Oh, maybe it's... Duh. Huh. Looks like Grace couldn't take the girls partying anymore, so she killed her and roped her husband into helping dump the body at Smithwick Quarry. I should get back and let her know. Okay, yes, I totally sucked at that. Man, I hope that gets better. Turns out... The reason you can't find your body is because it's not in the building. It's at Smithwick Quarry, about five miles out of town. Oh. Well, why'd they do it? The parties were keeping them awake at night. They finally got too tired and snapped. I, I thought they were just being unreasonable. I didn't know they would do this. <sighs> Thanks for your help. You have no idea how big a relief it is just knowing. No problem. You know, I never really liked cops. And they were always giving me shit, telling me how I was messing up my life. We never saw eye to eye on things. But you really came through for me. Probably should have listened to what they were trying to tell me. Maybe then things wouldn't have ended up like this. Thanks again. Okay, so I guess she's moved on. Yes, I did a horrible job at it, but I finished it. All right, now we gotta go back upstairs. Ooh, what is, something's just vibrating. Oh, because I went through, yeah, okay. I'm still not finishing sentences, I know this. Back through the stairwell. Let's 
see if creepy girl left us any more notes. I wonder why the lights do that. Wow, she has really done a number on this hallway. I guess I'm just wandering around through people's apartments. What are those things? Maybe she's getting too much sugar. I mean, that keeps kids awake, right? Uh-oh. I do not like that noise. <laughs> it just freaks me out every single time. scaring the little kid. Hey. You enjoy scaring kids? This little girl cost me everything. It was supposed to be a simple job. Easy money. What do you mean? She's just a kid. It don't matter what she is. Her daddy owed too much to the wrong people. She was just an insurance policy. Is that where you come in? A simple snatch and grab. After everything was settled up, I'd let her go. I'm guessing it wasn't so simple. That may be. But she owes me now. And I ain't leaving until her debt is paid. Cut your losses. It may be a while. Don't worry. I can wait. I've got nothing but time, my friend. Well, I just wanted to know why you were in the closet. How do I get rid of him? Typing. Don't guess I can yet. It's very steamy in here. Okay, I already got that one. Right, boy. What's like going on in here? Bats and hope your luck improves. It ain't about luck, Everine. You got that right, buddy. You might want to remember that when you look at your sorry track record. Well, there's always some. I never know if she likes me or she's just being nice. All right. Pull up your panties, gentlemen, and throw in some chips, Nate. Good lord, these boys are easy pickups. <laughs> A few more good cards would help. Okay, well, nothing going on here that shouldn't be. Yay, normal people. Oop, oop. Tomorrow, you know? Three more. Wow. Thank you. There's something going on in here. Uh, where'd he go? He just disappeared. See, is that the one I just came out of? Yes, it is.
If demons find you, they will hunt you down and suck your soul. Resid residue of ghost souls hides your presence from demons. You can move between hide objects to avoid demons. If demons can't find you for a while, they will stop checking and leave. Okay, that just freaked me out totally. Hold R1 to see demons through walls. Remember to always approach a demon carefully. He's just gonna stay there, so how am I supposed to get out? Is he looking at me or looking the other way? I think he's looking at me. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Okay, so let's hide while we try and figure this out. Horrible. Horribly. No clue. And how do I see him again? There it is. Can you fight him? Or... Where's the guy in the closet? I could take care of two things with one there. At least now I know what those are. Yikes. I know you guys must be getting bored, so let's just see if... Okay, here we go. Oh, crap. Oh, holding R2. Okay, that was a bit tricky, <laughs> but we got it. It's a whole lot easier than hiding. We're still trying to get to the fourth floor. Gosh, they're everywhere. Oh, they light up when they're looking at you. There are demons all over these people's apartment. This 
by far the worst birthday party ever. What do you mean? We got brews? We got TV? What more do you want? Uh, I don't know. Party, maybe? Cool. We could drive to Boston. Drive to Boston? I mean... Do I really have to go through the stove? I guess that's... <laughs> I don't want to go through the stove. I mean, logistically speaking, how do we work that out? You want to take your car? Well, you make a good point. Parking and the driving and the gas and what a lot of hassle, bro. Too much almost. Not to mention gas prices these days. Yeah, it's out of control. There's no gas sitting here. It's a good point. Okay, is that all of them? Oh, happy day. Back through the stove. Thank you. Two more. Why can't adventures happen without going outside? <laughs> they can. It's called video games. They're awesome. You know, I'd be fine just watching a video. What kind of adventure are you two guys going on? Who's this dude? 